Hi, and welcome to DWI, Drinking Without Income. I'm Amanda Dybert, and over here is one of my favorite drinking partners in crime, Caroline, who uh, really hates being on camera and is super excited that not only did I make her be a part of this, but I also put that awesome green bow on her head because this is our special holiday episode. Yay. It looks like a shoelace. You got some big shoes. Today, we are going to be reviewing the staple of all cheap wines, Carlo Rossi. We're going to be doing a Chianti. It was 5.39, as you can see from the twist up. And uh, yeah, this is uh, what? <laughs> so you <laughs> this don't is have what to. we're going to be trying. <laughs> so let's see if we can get how awkward this is on camera. You owe me like five different favors right now. I do, I owe so many favors. All right, here we go. Get a nice bouquet going. Mm, delicious. Mm -hmm. Oh God, it smells so bad. Oh God. <laughs> no, we're okay, gonna do it. Okay, 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 okay. Ugh. <laughs> Tastes like college. No, but I think we're Tastes, thinking the same thing. We are. Great. All right, we're gonna mull it. Awesome haircut. <laughs> <was gonna say, laughs> no. We're not gonna do that. <laughs> All right, you put me in a bow, but I'm not. So what we're gonna do is we are going to teach you how to make mulled wine, which disguises even the most disgusting of all disgusting, which is this. Yeah. We don't have to drink after we toast. Okay, so here we go. Mulled wine. Our little recipe book here. Mm -hmm. You can't see it, so I'm not going to try. It's really important. Right. What you're supposed to do first is have half of a lemon cut into curls of an appeal and a half of a peel of an orange cut into curls. But I don't have either of those things. Um, this lemon juice. I'm the cameraman now, so. Woman. Camera woman, Need sorry, two, comedy diva. Hi. Two tablespoons of sugar. So, Oosh. one tablespoon. You, you're supposed to do one teaspoon of allspice, but uh, this wine is really gross, so I'm gonna do a tablespoon. How much bigger is a tablespoon than a teaspoon, a really? Lot, a oh. lot bigger. So there you go. Great, There's I'm really qualified to do tablespoon of uh, allspice, ground cinnamon. But same thing, uh, we're going to go with two tablespoons. It's gross, but we're not going to totally fill the tablespoons, and then it will be sort of like teaspoons. Approximation is the best part of any cooking, yeah, I think. Yeah, and the more, the grosser the wine, the more seasoning you should add. And uh, then two so. teaspoons of ground cloves. Ground cloves. It's like yeah. Julia Child up in here. It is. Just the spoons. Yes. And then you take your three cups of boiling water. We've got our water boiling. Ooh. Pour that over the spices, so, and then you do two bottles Whoosh. of full-bodied red wine. Mm. This is about two bottles. Is it really? Big freaking jug. A liter and a half. Liters. So, Europe. whatever. Metric system. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Oh, Carlo Rossi. It's a European wine. Yeah. With European measurements. So classy. So classy. Get it too hot. You will boil all the alcohol out. If you boil all the alcohol, you have what is the fruit point. point? Yeah, no, 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 no. Then it's fruit punch. No, and your life is wasted. Ah, so, or not. And you add rum to it. Now, the only rum that we have is Malibu, and that would be fucking disgusting. So, what we have instead, which is also what I use at Thanksgiving, and it was delicious, was it not the mold wine? I did. It was. It was, it really, was good. really good. Yeah. Okay. Uh, is I have some brandy. So I'm gonna go get the brandy. I think brandy's better than rum brandy anyway. Than now that I have you to myself. And look, Never mind. In case we'll talk later. you doubt how my little book of a uh, thing doesn't say how much rum. Doesn't. So all the so, rum. Just some rum. We're just gonna put some rum in it. Now I am the camera woman and we <laughs> are ready for glass number two. Now mold in our Christmas mugs on my porch. Beautiful. Mm. So much better. Oh my god. Goes all the way down. Yes. Tastes yeah. like Christmas, Kwanzaa, Hanukkah, winter solstice. Sure, all those all things. All at once. Uh, yeah. This is great. Mm -hmm. No, it's also great. Your lights. Oh, well, thank you. Lights. Yeah, they're great. Thank you. The only thing I wish is that we uh, could afford one of those fancy lights with music combo mm. Display things. Oh, the, the blinky things? Mm -hmm. and the, yeah. 
Drop the beat. Da 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 da